Hello, everybody out there. Welcome to Gary Schumacher Exposes False Prophets here on YouTube. And we have a special guest tonight. We have in the house Robin Bullock Jr. Hello, Robin. Hello. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Happy to be here in Texas. Texas? This is New Jersey. You think a, a prophet would know where he is. So, Robin, um, uh, I'm, I'm glad to hear, hear because we, I've been dying to ask you a question. So what happened in the 2020 election? Don't judge the fire! Oh, no, oh, oh, I won't judge the fire, Robin, but I think you need a tic-tac. Oh, my Lord, that breath. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Oh, Lord, no, take it easy. Now, uh, so, so um, I understand that you are worth tw anywhere between 20 and $40 million. Is that true? Yes, yes it is. Um, crime does pay off, kids. Oh, well, I don't know about that, there. So, yes, and what I understand, you're an outstanding guitar player and singer. I understand that you really just got into this false prophecy thing just so your band would have a place to play. So, is that is there any truth to that? Maybe just a little. Well, maybe just a little. Maybe, maybe just a lot. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I think you're a better guitar player than you are a prophet because you're usually wrong about it. 50 to 60 to 70 percent of it. Ooh, all right there. You better pray tonight. Oh, I pray every night, but uh, I pray that Lock you. Your I, doors. I pray that you stop with this false prophecy stuff. That beard is working tonight, Robin. It is working tonight. I brushed it for once. <laughs> and I took a shower. I never take showers Ooh. or brush my beard or hair. Are you sure you had a shower tonight? Oh, yeah, about hair. I got a new hair clip today. Oh, that is a lovely new hair clip. Cheetah print. Uh, cheetah print. Yes, yeah. cheetah print goes well with your beard. And uh, very masculine. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so um, I understand you have a little song you want to play for us tonight. Yeah! Oh, yeah, because, you know, nobody loves to perform more than yeah. Robert Bullock. Unfortunately, we've had some technical difficulties here with audio, so I'm going to be playing the guitar, Robert. Thank you. I know I, can't, I cannot uh, even compare to your... Whoops. Rocking guitar styles, but I'm gonna do a little acoustic version. So we're gonna have Robin Bullock unplugged here tonight. Mm -hmm. All right, mm -hmm. let me move this up here so I can play my. This is gonna, this is gonna be a little. All right. Oh, oh, we gotta get the Gandalf staff out. Yes, you do. All right, are we ready? All right, let's sing it good and loud there. Yeah. All right, Three, Gandalf. Two, one, go. I like to deny your money, and money, and money. I like to deny your money. All right. Okay. Wow. That is an awesome Gandalf step you have there. Thank you. Um, I, I understand that Kat Kerr uh, blessed you with that, with her pink hair. Yep. And her, uh, her many, many trips. Well, I got to put this down. It's down on my face here. Her many, many trips to uh, heaven that she makes. Yep. And, and you and, and you. And, and now, recently I had um, Amanda Grace Jr. on this mm -hmm. show. And she says you and her are best friends. Yeah, um, mm -hmm, we are. Yeah. Very close, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. And does she false prophet as much as you? I do a little bit more than her. Oh, yes, I think you've been around a lot longer. A lot longer uh, than Amanda Gray. Oh, rude. <laughs> so, so, yes, and... Uh, so you're just going to just keep cranking out all these false prophecies as much as you can, huh? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a, and and uh, that's uh, that's not cool, dude. You gotta you gotta knock this stuff off. Well, I can't. I need all your money. Oh money, money. yes, you do. <laughs> yes you do. Well, I just don't know what to say to somebody like you. You know. Give me your money. Oh, was this a hold up? Yeah, Might as well be. Might as well be because you do prey on the uh, on the. Uh, the, the weak and feeble-minded, it seems to me. So, um, let's talk about a couple more of your prophecies that didn't come to pass, okay? So there was a train wreck uh, in Texas, and you pr prophesied three years ago that a train, a train, you said, 
And uh, now that was now that was and there was a train wreck and all those chemicals were spilled and you just took credit for that. So my question to you, Mr. Robin Bullock, I'm over here. Why didn't you go down there with all your millions of dollars and help those people since you predicted it? I can't. You see, I need all your money. And <laughs> That's I have right. to uh, keep it to myself and that. share with my bestie, Amanda Grace. Oh. Yeah, because, I mean, you know, just because you're, cause you made money off of that prediction, right? A lot of money. A lot of money. I like my money. money. I know you like money. your money, money. And it is uh, it is a shame that, you know, you, you profited off of other people's pain. It's, that's official now. I really don't care about that. I know, and that you, neither you or Amanda Gray seem to care. You just need a lot of money. I know, and that's what they're doing, folks. They're taking all your money, money. Okay. Money, money, money. Now this is going to be a top ten hit uh, by. A, in, I don't know if it's a. Is it's got country song or is it pop? I'm not sure yet. But uh, you know, look for it on the, the Grammys this year because that's how Robin rolls. He makes money, money. Money, money, money. I like taking all your money, money, money. <laughs> and, and don't judge the what? The fire that comes out. That's of my right. Mouth. Don't judge the fire to come out of his mouth. Not unless you got a tic tac. All right, so that's good. We're going to make it quick tonight because Robin's got more people to fleece in, in, in the flock. So we're going to get on out of here. So uh, you got anything to say before we leave there, Robin Bullock Jr.? Uh, go to my channel. Give me some money, like a lot of it, maybe all of it. Maybe I will sell it for like $10 bucks or something. Oh, yes, that's called uh, sowing a seed. So if you give Robin $1,000, it'll come back to you threefold. How's that been working out, folks? It's been working out too good, I'll bet. I just took it for myself. Yes, she, yes, she, yes, he does. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh, well, you, well, you are that. wearing a hair clip. I don't know. Maybe you were one of those, uh, you know. Maybe I need to keep my hair out of my face. Oh, you're not doing a very good job of that. <laughs> All right. Um, All right, so we're going to get on out of here because uh, Robin Jr.'s microphone is about ready to die. So yes. say good night to all your followers, Robin. Good night. Ah! Good night, everybody. Hope you like this. Take a note of money.